Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, then hey, I'm Leah. If you are new here, make sure that I can't. I'm talking too fast. I've had too much caffeine. What else is new? If you are new here, make sure to hit that big subscribe button down below because we are getting so close to 800 subscribers and I am so freaking excited. Yeah, I post college and lifestyle videos all the time, so subscribe down below to catch all of those. So this is about the time of year that I get a lot of DMs from you guys asking me why I chose Bing and stuff like that. I'm gonna tell you what was going on in Leah's head as a senior in high school. Let's, let's flashback. So I was one of those people that knew for a long time even like early high school, what I wanted my major to be, I always was interested in engineering and building and designing things. I love it so much. I am so like genuinely passionate about it. So one of the first things I looked for when looking for schools was a good engineering program. Now, once I knew they had a substantial engineering program, they were on my radar, but I wasn't like very much sold on whether or not I wanted to go there yet. So what I did at this point was tour. I toured September of my senior year. So that was pre COVID. The tour is like, when I tell you that's what sold me, the tour was it. Like I had a really, really sweet tour guide and it was just like a really good and positive experience like walking around there and I also went on like a really nice bright and sunny day in September when everyone was like outside studying and like out doing work and hanging out with friends during the day and it was just it felt like a really nice environment to be in but yeah I think going on a tour is so so important because there were some schools that like I thought looked perfect and like really good for me on paper but then when I went there like felt entirely different so I would definitely try and get a feel for the school you're applying to and just like go and tour there if you can't do that I also have some videos up on my channel of campus tours of Bing so definitely check that out if you guys want to another reason why I chose it was because of the size so a lot of schools like you can look online and see like 20,000 undergraduate 5,000 undergraduate students and just have no idea of like how big or small that feels but like when I went to Bing it felt like the perfect size there were people around you could easily walk around Bing and like go to class and like not run into one person you know or you could run into 20 like it's that kind of like it's kind of like an in between type size and I like that a lot personally they also had a lot of clubs well currently have a lot of clubs so many different clubs to join personally for me i'm very big into music so i am in an acapella group i'm in rhythm method and there are 10 acapella groups at bing which is a lot and there are just literally so many other clubs and things to do to get involved in there are a lot of specific clubs to my major as well but there's also just tons of stuff to do outside of my major and i love that i have the option to join both of those things it's also a nice distance from home for me because i knew that i wanted to be able to go somewhere that i was like far enough away from home that i would have to like learn to do things on my own and be more independent but also so close enough that I can go home with a car ride or a bus and not need to literally fly to get home. I also applied to their freshman research program and I got into that. There are different research streams. I think there was about nine different research streams when I applied, all different STEM fields and things that you could be interested in to apply and do research as a freshman. Mine was very difficult to do over Zoom and it was very rough for me. I definitely recommend you guys try that out and apply if you are in a STEM field because I have a lot of friends that had a lot better of a time with it because theirs was more in person. Yeah, that's it for now. I hope you guys liked this and found it helpful and as always, feel free to leave any more comments and down below or DM me on Instagram. I always love talking to you guys and yeah, see you guys very soon. Bye guys.